Cannabis interacts with the brain's endocannabinoid system, which regulates motivation and reward processing. When cannabinoids bind to receptors in the ventral striatum, dopamine rises temporarily. This creates a sense of satisfaction or contentment in the present moment. But this satisfaction signal makes future-oriented tasks feel less urgent or compelling. The brain interprets the dopamine release as evidence that current conditions are already adequate. Over time, with repeated exposure, baseline motivation can decrease as the reward system adapts. The prefrontal cortex, which manages goal-directed behavior, receives fewer signals that effort is necessary. Effort feels optional rather than essential. Long-term goals feel less compelling because the brain's reward prediction has been altered. This isn't loss of ambition or character change. It's altered reward signaling in a brain that adapted to chemically induced ease. When exposure decreases, the endocannabinoid system gradually restores its natural function. Motivation returns as the brain relearns to generate drive from internal goals rather than external substances. If this helped, subscribe for real talk on mental health.